The quality of the audio in your video or movies can make all the difference in providing extra layers of interest to your audience. Most clips that you capture will have some of their own audio. Take for instance this one here, let me just play it through for you. So you can see we've got some great atmospheric sound there of the guys working on the car. And we really want to keep these bits, but we want to add some extra to the video itself. For instance, we might want to add in a soundtrack as well. And we've got one here. I'm just going to drag it down to the soundtrack. And then let's play that through at the same time. I'll go back to the beginning. So we've got a great soundtrack, but some of the atmosphere has been lost because it's overpowering some of the sound effects and some of the atmospheric recording that we've got with the original. If we then go and add in some narration as well, this complicates matters even further. Let me just turn off the sound from the video to start with. So I'll just right click here and just turn off enable. And I'll just right click here and turn off the soundtrack so that we can just hear the narration. The most famous of all the V8 supercar events is the Bathurst 1000. Here the best teams go head to head for the full 24 hours over the mountain in Bathurst. So the idea is that we want to try and mix together the soundtrack, the narration and the audio from our video. So let me just go and re-enable that and the background as well. And you can hear straight away if I go back to this point in our clip and try to play all three together we just end up with a messy mix of sound. There's no clear dominant sound coming through. Some sound that should be in the background is actually too prominent in the mix. Premiere Elements has great audio mixing tools. All we need to do is go to the audio drop down menu here. And if we go through to audio mix, you see that we have the ability to adjust using these slider controls each of the sounds. We've got the audio from our video, the narration, and also the soundtrack. So we can drop down the levels of each individual one or boost the levels of other ones throughout the mix. Now one way that we could do this is simply to play through our clip and adjust these controls as the sound is coming through boosting up the narration when we need it and dropping down the soundtrack and the audio from our video when we need to as well. But we even have a smarter way of working. So if we close down the audio mixer and open up Smart Mixer, you'll see we have the ability to nominate what is foreground sound and what is background sound and get Premiere Elements to actually go through and make some of those decisions for us. You can also find this Smart Mixer option, if I just close down this pop-up. Under the Audio drop-down menu, you can see it here. If we go down to Options to start with, this gives us the ability to nominate what's foreground and what's background. In our situation, we want the audio from the video to actually be background. We also want the soundtrack to be background, which it is, and we want the narration to be foreground so that we can actually hear what's going on there. Let's just click apply now and see what happens. And you can see immediately that audio keyframes have been added to our audio files and that those are dropping down the sound at different points and boosting the sound at other points. I'm going to customize that just a little bit by dragging up our clip volume for the narration as well. So let's just hear how that sounds. I'll go back to this point here. The most famous of all the V8 supercar events is the Bathurst 1000. Here, the best team... We do have the narration coming through fairly well at the beginning, but you can see here how our keyframes have jumped back up. I'm just going to click and drag this one down a little bit lower and do the same for our soundtrack. And let's just try that again. The most famous of all the V8 supercar events is the Bathurst 1000. Here, the best teams go head to head for the full 24 hours over the mountain in Bathurst. We could afford to have the soundtrack just a little bit louder at that point, so I'll just drag these two points up. 
and I think we're ready to go. So let's see how that sounds. The most famous of all the V8 supercar events is the Bathurst 1000. Here, the best teams go head to head for the full 24 hours over the mountain in Bathurst. So using the Smart Mixer feature, Premier Elements has provided us with the keyframes in exactly the spots that we need in order to mix the narration, the audio from our video and the soundtrack together. And all we needed to do was a couple of small tweaks to these keyframes in order to get the levels just right.